Oh my goodness, Autumn. It's January 4th and we forgot to tell everybody Happy New Year's. Ah! Oh, wait a minute. Did it carry the one? Oh, Biblical New Year's is until March. <laughs> well, we're good. We're good. Don't worry about it. It's because people have spoken against the Most High and changed his calendar. And we live in a world that doesn't like the Most High's ways. But we do, don't we? Yeah. Yeah. We follow Yeshua. Yes, we do. Daniel chapter 7. He shall speak words against the Most High, and shall wear out the saints of the Most High, and shall think to change the times and the law, and they shall be given into his hand for a time. And a lot of people don't like the Apocrypha, but it's because they don't know how to test Scripture, huh? But we do. Yeah, we know how to test Scripture. And what does it tell us about the calendar? Jubilees chapter 6. But if they do neglect and do not observe them according to his commandment, then they will disturb all their seasons. I know. I know. It's terrible. It's terrible. But we're trying to get back to his ways. And the years will be dislodged from this order. And they will disturb the seasons. And the years will be dislodged. And they will neglect their ordinances. And all the children of Israel will forget and will not find the path of the years. And will forget the new moons and the seasons and the Sabbaths. And they will go wrong as to all the orders of the years. I know. It's horrible. We don't want to forget these things. You see, guys, even my infant newborn daughter knows that we shouldn't be forgetting God's commandments and that we should do it his way and keep his calendar. Yeah. See? Mwah. See? Yay. We love doing it the Father's way, the same way that Yeshua did it, huh? Yeah, definitely. Mm -hmm. Yes.